Why are you working so hard? Huh? All right, guys. So Kim Lim just called, and she's having a little bit of crisis. We are supposed to go for the opening this weekend called Papila, and she's actually opening in Bangkok, Thailand. However, there's a lot of things that needs to be done before the opening. She needs help, and we gotta go shoot. But I actually can't make it tomorrow. You guys. Daryl is free. No, you guys are free. You guys are free. I literally look on the calendar. There's nothing for the both of you. Why are you editing now? Nothing. Exactly. Exactly. You guys are heading to Bangkok. Like when? Tonight! We just gotta book the flights now. And we're gonna head up. Okay, Dasha, let's book the flights. Yeah. So, uh, you guys have to be at the airport at 5am. Huh? 5? Later? Yeah. Please? <laughs> 5 oh 5 But you might be late, so try to be there at 5. How long is the flight? Wow. That's in, there's more than enough time to sleep guys. Let's go and then I'll see you guys the day after. Hi guys! Okay, so look what's happening today. We're in my Thai office and I'm going to be opening Papilla Hair Care which is one of my brands, one of my babies here in Thailand tomorrow. So this is my office. So we're busy today. Pre oh, okay, this is my office and this is like my marketing team here. And then you have the meeting room there. So it's like a bit messy now. So now we're going to go over to my shop which is going to be handed over today. But because I'm pregnant, so it's very fun. Um, so they don't allow me to go basically when you know we're unpacking and then like moving the furniture but after the main moving is done I'll be going down after so let's go hi guys so now I'm in the shop so basically they finished fixing up the furniture and like moving everything so I'm kind of allowed back but not really because they are still drilling the sink inside which was supposed to be done yesterday so a teeny bit of crisis but still okay so now we're just trying to organize everything so they can do the deep cleaning later so okay enjoy watching me pack <laughs> actually wait I saw something see <laughs> <laughs> I actually sneak in to have a look at my new Labubu. See, it just launched today. We'll do some unboxing later, but let me do this thing first. <laughs> no, actually, because they went, my staff went to like go outside and haggle for me. Yeah. Oh my god, that's a lot. Okay, today launch, then it's like everybody, apparently a lot of Singaporean outside like... Trying to buy. Yeah, trying to buy also. So I told my mom, go, must help me. <laughs> Okay, quite okay lah like, actually. This like movie chair. Perfect. Okay. Ayo. Okay. And then drop on me. <laughs> okay, so basically we we're supposed to do training today, but after one whole day, as usual, the sink is still leaking. So you know because we have to wash hair, right? Because this is papilla. So we just open a bit and then whole floor is like wet so we can't resume our training today so today is the 4th October but right tomorrow is our opening but everything is still leaking and we still haven't done the training because we have like really new therapists coming so it's like oh my god really crisis crisis we have to continue tomorrow <laughs> today is 5th of October right so it's our shops Papilla Thailand first day opening but soft launch because I know when you open a store it's like you know when you open a store it's like full of messes and everything so okay so this is the four face Buddha it's a very famous Buddha in Thailand called Papong and then our shop is just here in era one so today we are giving prayers to the God to take care of our shop to bless us to bless me with Sun Sun Lili Ping Ping An An good business and we thank you for Sort of taking care of me and then the company while we are going to be setting up here in Thailand and for everything before that is done. So we hired 88 dancers and then gave uh, eight baby elephants to like show our sincerity and our wishes. Like you know when we make a wish and then we like you know give something. So if the wish comes true, we will give back like bigger and bigger and bigger elephant. That kind of thing lah. So yes. Hi guys, so, okay, so basically now we're doing training, in-house training for all our new therapists in Thailand. So basically because we are the first in Thailand to do this kind of like non-surgical machine technology for the scalp. 
so basically no one here knows how to do anything <laughs> so it's like you know a whole new thing so we got to take in like a lot of like uh, trainees and try to like test their hands-on skill which is washing now we're going to do washing in the basin and then after that we will move on to the machine to show them first how to do and then after that let them try with the to play test and play with the machines so it's going to be a tough journey but if we can do it hopefully we can do well this is all oil so all these are all oil these are all for beans uh, so basically now we are training Anne how to wash my hair. So they are teaching her like the steps of washing the hair correctly. It's like left to right, right to left, whichever. And then the sections to cover. But now we are having a problem with the water. So we made it finally to Papila. In Bangkok, Thailand. in Thailand, wow. we are a few days late but because we had some stuff going on. So we were supposed to come for the opening but I guess the opening's not happening. So let's go find out what things have been happening. Yes, you guys made it. But I'm so tired, oh my god, totally no way. I need to do it as much. How's your, where's your go eat? Thank you. Still crisis thing, so not open yet. What's the crisis? Uh -huh. No, no stuff. No stuff. My staff gave up yesterday after doing. She said too difficult to do everything here. Yeah. yeah. You can take Isaac. So tiring, eh? I won't give up, ready. No giving up. Okay, we'll have a look around. Yeah, we're not like a movie room. So yesterday my this therapy is supposed to do the hair but she said too difficult. So okay. maybe we let her do facial. So we're testing now and training. At least the renovation is done, right? Yeah, and at, least, at least it looks good, right? It's very crazy. I'm so tired. I'm tired of being pregnant. Cannot get pregnant. Cannot do many things. Then so tired, then back ache, then what ache, then my leg pain. <laughs> but no choice that I really open just have to walk along, right? Singapore staff. Say hi! Hi, Singapore staff. Are you also from Singapore? Yeah. My other love is here. We put like display now in the store. Actually, this one of my staff gave to me. Hi, baby. This is a Thailand limited edition, by the way. Oh, really? I still don't understand the hype. Not let Debbie have one because it will never stop with one. I know, I know. I won't, I won't even have one. It's either nothing or like everything. Welcome to Papila, Thailand. What is this for? Okay, these are the masa scents. Uh, you can choose your own. So there's different scents. Yeah, and, and we get a nice shoulder massage. Yeah, <gasps> we're gonna so, provide a little bit of massage for customers. Wow, sounds very relaxing. And Thais give the best massages, so I'm very excited. We're using not our own old stuff, we're using new one day trained wow. staff for them. You say half a day trained. <laughs> so this is the one that gave up on the scalp and asked me to do face. So we will try. We really went like two rounds. Maybe she's very good at the face. Maybe right? let's Maybe see. I don't so know. Good at doing but I face. really don't know because our machine is quite limited only to us. It's my turn now and I'm gonna do a facial. <laughs> I'm very excited. We're in Papila in Bangkok. And not only can you do your hair, you can also do your face here. So it's very special and Check out how beautiful the interior is. It's super relaxing. I feel like we're forcing before I even say anything, but. Let's go to our room. Maybe she come back and then like her one eye is like here. <laughs> new store, new stuff. Okay. Let's see how it goes. Good luck, Debbie. Good luck. You're all can go. As you see, this is a couple room. Wow. Actually, I will give you two, but we got no stuff. No worries, no worries. If I would have let, how do, but no stuff, so he cannot do it. <laughs> this is supposed to be the couple room. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm going to do. Just in it for the right. Okay, hydration. Yeah. I'm gonna start my facial now and I'm, I feel like I'm gonna sleep. This whole place is so cozy and this bed just relaxes you. It's like reclined all the way. We're gonna do a hydrating facial by the way. I'm going to the toilet <
We had a massage and I did the LDN facial and also like a mask and it feels really nice and comfortable. I can't wait to come back next time and I want to do my hair. There's like hair treatment for like hair growth and uh, if you have any like scalp problems, they also can help with that. So very happy. I think my skin looks nice and glowy. Thank you for Pila for having me on such a nice experience. So we were supposed to come here for the opening but because of big crisis, crisis <laughs> it is not happening today or tomorrow. Yeah. It will probably happen though. We'll soft launch now, do KOLs and then slowly with customers coming in. But I think maybe grand opening now have to wait for me to give birth first. Oh nice. Then come. So we'll come back again. So we, we'll be back for the grand like, opening. Yeah, next year. Let me open and then sling down first and get back my old self. <laughs> so for now, we can just show Kim working, which is one yeah. of the next questions that I have. Why are you working so hard? Huh? Have to work hard, my Those people who want to succeed have to hustle from the bottom. But you know, you're, you're, you're pregnant. Do you want to just like chill? No, I know. I also want to baby. chill. Oh, you I want, want to you chill. Want to chill. I really you want got to no choice. choice. But I cannot chill. I got no choice. This is choiceless. Yeah. Really, no choice. I got no choice. I'm choiceless. But it's so yeah. impressive. I remember at this point, I was like, I was dead really. I was like a whale. Like cannot move. But he's yeah. like flying back and forth from Singapore <laughs> to Thailand to settle all of these. I'm very confused how she it's had so the energy. Tiring, yeah. Yeah. But it's so tiring. It's no choice. And, and another thing is, why are you opening in Bangkok? Oh, because I feel Bangkok is the like opportunity, you know, there's like 100 million population here and then like they are so, I find that they are very advanced in their beauty things they and are, yeah, they are. but no one does scalp yet here, hair, hair loss without surgery and that's our expertise so I feel like maybe there's a market because we like Thailand a lot too, I like Bangkok a lot, we like Bangkok a lot, a great <laughs> so you know, opening a business here means more reason to come back. We went, we went here on the first day. I mean their first day, yeah. but I heard that you were carrying a lot of stuff. Oh like, yeah, yeah, the, yeah. Of course, got not enough people, no choice. Oh I just have to, it's just, no, it's just one of those things. I don't know, are you supposed to carry stuff? No, yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. Really, no. Yeah, they said I keep bending now and carrying, but won't be Yeah, got it, you, got it. Yeah. Yeah. But I'm sure everything will go smoothly yeah. and Congratulations! March. Yeah. yeah, congrats, congrats. Thank you. And in March, I'm pretty sure. That I hope the, in March, by March, yeah, we'll by be March, rolling, hopefully. rolling them filled with customers and staff. Yeah. Well, you guys will see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. see. Stay tuned. So stay tuned. <laughs> and uh, good luck. Congrats. Thank you. Yay, congratulations! So proud.